Fox News has just received breaking news from the Justice Department that has significant ramifications for the 2016 presidential campaign. The U.S. Justice Department has just released a statement to the press indicating that Hillary Clinton will face charges as a result of the so-called server gate investigation. The press release was signed by the head of the Justice Department, Attorney General Loretta Lynch. According to Lynch, the indictments will relate specifically to three emails found on her server that were shared with her longtime Clinton friend and ally, Sidney Blumenthal, who will also face charges. Attorney General Lynch stated in the press conference, the nature and depth of the charges will be fully explained in a press conference we have scheduled for Monday, April 4th at 3 p.m. The full nature of these charges have been relayed to Secretary Clinton's attorneys. We can only tell you at this time that these charges are serious and multiple involving felony and misdemeanor charges at the federal level. Fox News contacted the Justice Department, but were informed that the Attorney General would offer no additional comment at this time. Fox News has learned from anonymous sources within the Justice Department that the charges could carry with them penalties as high as life in prison. Some within the Justice Department also speculate that the indictments are a result of Clinton's failure to cinch the nomination and prove to be a viable candidate for the general election, that the Obama administration and the Obama camp within the Democratic Party have decided to offer up Clinton in the hope of bolstering their chances in November against a potential Donald Trump candidacy. Speculation grows that Al Gore may be called to be selected in the Democratic Convention, though others assert that the Dems are committed to rallying around Bernie Sanders, while other names include Joe Biden, Michael Bloomberg, and even one of the older Kennedys. Fox News will keep you up to date on this breaking news as we get more information. Meanwhile, let's bring in Carl Rove to talk about the political ramifications of this decision by Attorney General Lynch.